simulation's going off. It's good to be back here at X Games. The world's best throwing down. Yeah, it's been fun to watch the X Games grow. Each year it just seems to get bigger and bigger. And this is really where ski cross got its start. It's a sport that Zach and I helped pioneer in the early years. And to be honest, we take a lot of pride in knowing that this sport will debut in the Olympics this year. Nice to be back here at the X Games. And uh, I'll say this, it's a different feeling being here as a uh, commentator for ESPN than it was as a racer. Yeah, the rules are simple in ski cross. The fastest man to the bottom wins. So we're making our way down here. It's the racers' first look here at this course. And uh, it's really important that they figure out how much speed they're gonna be carrying at certain points in this course. As you can see right here, we're standing on the takeoff of about a 40-foot gap. The landing is actually higher than the takeoff, so uh, not enough speed here could be a real disaster. When you look at jumps like this, that's when you think to yourself, it's a good day to be a commentator. The reality is, is once you come out of the starting gate with five other racers at your side, it's all really a game of improvisation. You don't really know where you're going to end up, but uh, I'll tell you, at a high rate of speed, you have nanoseconds to figure it out. crazy weekend there's so much going on you got Snoop Dogg at night and 50 Cent during the day and when you get to the end of the week and it sort of signifies a transition put away the race skis time to go skiing in the big country we're going north <laughs> 